Hello everyone, this is CypherDeck and today we're back in Outward and we are going to be heading towards the Southern Bandit Camp uh, over to the Vigil or, um, or Sigil, the, whatever it's called. Let me take a look at the map here. The Vigil Pylon, uh, we're also going to go to Zan's boat, but right now we're right about here. We're going to go down to the Bandit Camp and check it out. But I did see this, and there is a fellow inside. Um, nothing of great importance there. But yeah, I think, so there's that. It means that we're going to go this way. We may actually go past that, go to Yazan's, and then maybe head over there. Just to, just to shake things up, not not go by any kind of set, um, a, I don't know, direction. Just so we can, we can, you know, explore. We may actually go over to there. I don't know. We'll, we'll see. We'll see. We're not going to make plans right now. I, I do want to go to this bandit camp, though, because the last one was very profitable. Uh, you can see the seam line. There, I get. I don't know if that would be a seam line or or what, but I guess it wouldn't because it kind of ends and you, you're not really seeing through the world. Usually, if you're gonna see a seam in a in a game, it's usually gonna be something leading to something specific like that. All right, so that leads to that tower. We still haven't been to that tower, but I think. This is where the bandit camp is. I'm interested in what that tower is about. It's on fire or smoking. Maybe someone's there that we can talk to. So we'll see. We I honestly don't have any specific plans. I still want to go and check out Yazan's place, but honestly, I'm I'm more interested in just seeing what we're gonna get into here. All right, let's go ahead and. We got a guard there, it looks like. Let's see here. I'm gonna go ahead and use this. And, uh. Let's just get it going. Hey, buddy. How's it going? Oh, if you haven't seen me yet, you're about to see me. <laughs> Okay, looter garb. Uh, R, that's what I was going for. Yeah, I don't think that's a seam so much. Maybe that's just how it's supposed to be. But it looks kind of weird. Alright, so we don't want to get overrun here. Let's go ahead and try to check down here first. Got uh, some kind of docks going on. There's a there's a guy down there. Well, it's kind of exposed, so let's go ahead and I shot way ahead of him. Shot way behind him. Uh, behind him again. <laughs> Hey, how's it going, guy? Uh, let's get our weapon. Stay down on the ground. Who do you think you are? Let's take all that. Actually, we should torch it until we're about ready. Looks like we can go up there. <clears throat> Is there anything down here of note? Other than the creaky... Oh, yeah, there is. Hey. Let's go get that. Oh, we did get hit, so let's get a bandage on. Oh, and you, you know what? Uh, we should probably be... Uh, 
Should probably be getting my mana back. Oh, look at that. We got an upgraded to our tent. Or to our bedroll thing. I think I can make a Feng shield. And we'll just take all that. Alright. So let me, uh, let me take a look at my inventory real quick. Um... Simple tent, one made tent that helps protect against the weather compared to the bedroll. Sleeping in uh, this tent gives you a small bonus to stamina use. Okay, cool. So, uh, yeah, let's go to this guy up here that we just killed. And so why? I need to figure out what key this is <laughs> well, I can't figure it out so we're just gonna go ahead and do this and this there we go let's see where our next guy is okay there's a looter Uh-oh. Yeah, that's kind of what I heard. Four. E. Not getting back up, guy. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. Oh! I didn't even see that. Look at that wind up. That's <laughs> hey, I'll take that. And that. That wind up was pretty dope. I was not expecting that at all. Alright, let's go ahead and get number one going. And a number five. What is it? Johnny is Alive? Or I can't remember what the movie It's been a long time. If you even know what movie I'm talking about, leave it in the comments below. Because I don't remember the name of it. I think it was Johnny 5 is Alive! <laughs> okay, we've got another looter over there. Or, or bandit. Ooh, that's a spear guy, too. Love those spear guys. We got another chest over here. Make sure we don't fall for any traps. See, there's a trap right there. I almost fell for it. Oh, dude. We're getting full half flight over here. Okay, we're going to have to... Looks like we're going to have to work on... Oh, what? Here I was. I thought I was good to go. Don't find. Don't worry about it. All right. I still got some some good potions on me. I could drop a. Let's go ahead and grab a, a potion. Let's make this. It's, it's bad decisions, man. Bad decision choices. What we got in here? See, this, this looks like the big guy's tent. Got the two dragon heads on top. See, why aren't there any dragons in the game, man? That's what I want. Alright. My turn. Get that shield up. Stay down. I don't even know why I'm looting that. Okay, I haven't found a key or anything. I wonder if this is going to let me in here. 
Let's go up here first. Check for any things. All right, let's, let's sort our inventory here. Um, I'm going to go ahead and put that in there. I'd like to take this. I mean, we could make it into a fanged great axe and see what it turns into, like, as far as the look. I'm all about that look now. Let's go ahead and throw some of these in there and drop these in there. Uh, iron sword as well. Alright, let's go see what this, uh, this is about. Oh, we need to get our torch on. Oh, <laughs> shield situation. All right, let's go ahead and drink one of these. Protects against the cold. And it looks like we're going to have to go with this. Or we're just not going to be able to move. Okay, so this is an actual building here, it looks like. Anything there. Bandit Prism. Hmm. See, look at how nice and lush that looks. I like that. Why can't we have that? All right. Take that for sure. Protecting a chest. Let's see if we can go this way. Bandit camp key is required. Let me guess. The bandit camp key is right there. Alright. Let's take a look here. Let's... Do I have anything? Element resistance temporarily grants moderate resistance to fire, frost, Lightning decay. Okay, so it's like an all-in-one boon, maybe? Let's go ahead and take that. And then we're going to combat. We're going to go ahead and throw on this. Because it looks like he's he has some kind of spell thing going on. And I really wish I had a, uh, uh, what is it? An extra one of these that I could just throw at him. All right. Well, wish me luck. I feel this is going to go very, very badly. Here he comes. Oh, that's interesting. He gave me his back. Okay, I staggered him a little bit. Sta he's down. He's down. He's 
Okay, so I need to just stay on him. I'm, I'm, I'm getting him with the impact so nicely with this weapon. It's no, no reason I should be able. To, okay, okay, get a shield. Let's get, let's get that impact down. Keep him staggered. Keep him going down. He is so low. Oh, we got him. We got him. We got him. Okay, what, what, what do you got? So Wendigo. And there it is, the bandit key. Oculent remains. We'll definitely take those. Uh, we're gonna overweight ourselves here, but we're definitely taking that. Oh, we don't have two predator bones. If we had two predator bones, we could um, upgrade this just to, just even to see what it looks like. So we're gonna put this stuff in here, but. We did good, I think. I mean, he, he got us with a cold kind of thing. What is that, by the way? It's that negative effect. Chill, frost damage, and, uh, and resistance, negative 25. Okay, let's get a bandage going. And also, let's get some meat stew going so we can... Start healing from that. Okay, this is um, love, the lovely site in here. Let's see what we got in here. Ho! Oh, oh. Ho! Got a broad dagger. Um, we may become a, a, a dagger wielding uh, caster fellow. Alright, so let's open this guy. What we got? We got an ornate chest. We also have a. Um, okay, no, it's just the ornate chest. Black plate armor. Oh my gosh. This game is hating me right now. Elemental immunity. Okay, well, we're taking that. Let's go ahead and just open our inventory here. Because we're going to. Okay. Two protection. 14 resistance. 3 protection. 23 resistance. Impact resistance is 19. 11. Cold weather defense. 10. Hot weather defense. Negative 15. Nothing. And then the stamina cost. So overall, this is this is a better get. Um, do I really want to get rid of that half plate? No. Um, I'm seeing all kinds of decisions here that I'm, the ruby isn't going to weigh me anything. Um, let's go ahead and get rid of that. Uh, is there anything I can make here that would make this better? So none of this, like this right here, these low weight items. And I could move that up to here maybe, but that's going to make me overweight. Move that down to there. I do have my shield on. You're going over there. Just click it. Just click it. Okay. Uh, yeah, you know? I don't need that anymore. That's five weight right there. I'll need that. There's no reason to take that with me. Real question. Can't move. No. Cannot move yet. Our, uh, just trying to what 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 am I missing? What can I get rid of here that will give me that ability? I I think I might just have to leave the half plate behind. Can I carry this? I can. 
that half plate though. You know that half plate's gonna be money. You know it's gonna be money. And this is more for looks. So I I'm gonna I'm gonna just mess around and try to get this to where I need it. I'm you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and empty this. Oh no, what? No, don't take my shrimp away from me. Let's go ahead and use that. Get get our drink on. And uh now can I move? No. Trying, I'm trying to get this, get this to work. I I just don't know what what it's coming down to. Like how much weight is it coming down to? That's 12 weight. That's 19 weight. Uh, you know what? I know what I can do here. I know what I can do. Let's put that on. That brings that down. I can grab that. And that's it. I'm, I'm not overweight completely. And I'm, I'm, able, to, I'm able to move. But if I, if I throw in the torch... I'm stuck. <laughs> so I'm gonna have to, it's just gonna be a long long walk home. Alright, we made it back to town and I wanted to just show off this armor that we got. So this is the black um the black plate armor. And then we also have this here. This is the half plate armor. And then this is our robe that we, we wear. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and put this on, but we're gonna sell. We're gonna sell it. I'll also, I wanted to take a look here. Did I check to see if? Wait, let's check to see if we have any primitive bones. Do we have any primitive bones? Uh, I would think they'd be right around here if we did. By the way, I don't know if I showed this, but I ended up getting a power coil out of one of those boxes. thought that was uh, pretty neat. Um, let's go ahead and throw this key in here because you never know. And um, let's, bring, let's bring our money with us because we may want to buy something. Trying to think if there's. Uh, let's go ahead and put these away. Uh, seaweed. Shrimp that away. All right. Let's go sell some things. Now again, I'm not. I'm not really entirely sure if I want to get rid of this dagger. We may actually use it instead of a shield. Uh, that way we have um, a little bit more mobility, a little bit more, another way that we can attack. But it means being really close and getting um, into areas we may not normally be able to get into. So let's see if there's any bones in here. There's not. Alright. Is there something you need? Actually, now that I'm able to target you, let me go ahead and put that there. Is there uh, something you need? And let's see what we can say. Oh, 168 right there. 41. We haven't tried this yet. I, I definitely want to try that on. And uh, do you have primitive bones or anything like that? I know it's probably wasteful to get primitive bones, but... This is the lower of the two sleeping bags. It's the fur tent versus the simple tent. I may, I'm going to go ahead and sell that. I'm going to splurge a little bit. I might get that tent right there. Anything else? Let's go ahead and finish our transaction there. 
Uh, and let's take a look at these other weapons here. So, the dagger. Go and put that in. Look at that. Look at that thing. Looks pretty cool. I don't. I didn't even notice how much it sold for, but I know you buy it for like two hundred. And there's that two-handed sword. It's a interesting look to it. It is more damage than what we currently have, but on, honestly, it it's not it's not uh, as good because this also inflicts confusion. And it's 38 impact. So this is definitely the better rod to go with that. And we only have one attack for daggers. Uh, we may want to just sell is it. Is there something you need? Because there's things that we're going to be wanting to buy when we leave this area. And I, I don't want to really have to worry about it right now. So these are both really good numbers for those. So let's go ahead and sell that. We are at 335. Let's go ahead and buy the one gold the gold bar he has. Um, oh, we also need to get some. Um, Is there something you need? Some of that there. Do I still have? No, no, no. I, uh, nope. Let's go finish that transaction. I wouldn't think that this person would have primitive bones. Let's check uh, this guy over here. Greetings, friend. So he has obsidian. He has an assassin tongue. I think I can make a weapon out of that, like a um, that causes bleeding. The assassin. The assassin's sword. I think it takes one of those. A steel. Um, a steel saber. And something else. But is, is that going to be the weapon for us? I don't, I don't think so. Uh, we will take some, some bolt gold bars though. I think we're getting to the point that once we once we clear uh, the rest of the places on this map that we're going to be heading heading out. So I'm going to go ahead and sort my inventory real quick. Head uh, towards uh, Yazan's boat. I think that's the next next logical location, and then we'll decide where we're going to go from there. We may end it there and make this a short video I mean we've been doing hour long videos uh, we can make this one a little bit shorter just let's see what's what Yazan may have in store for us and then and then uh, go from there also I want to make sure I sleep before I leave because these need repair also I don't need to be carrying the sword with me I don't, I don't see a reason for that and until I have uh, the other primitive bones, I really don't need to be carrying that with me either. Uh, let's see here. Keep those. Put that there. We are now at 700 gold, my friends. 700. That is that is a, a lot of skills that we have available to us. Alright, uh, we don't need these. We'll definitely keep those on us. And, uh, yeah, I'll go ahead and, uh, sleep. Oh, yeah, let's go ahead and check out this, this new tent that we have, just to see what it looks like. Okay, definitely different. Oh, that is, I really like the way they, they have you build that. Alright, let's go ahead and take it down. So it takes it that way, okay. That's, that's it for a tent for whenever we're out in the, the cold. Of course, that's probably going to destroy us if we go to the desert. Alright guys, I will see you once we get closer to his hands. So as I said before, uh, we're going to be going a little random. 
I was on my way over to these ends. I was like, you know, there's that thing up here. It might be something small. Be able to go over, take a look at it, and then be back on our merry way pretty quickly. So why not just go over there and check it out? So that's what we're doing right now. So this looks like one of those places where there would be a statue. Um... And just to give you context, there's that over there, and there's that there. Uh, I'm guessing... Okay, that's a mana stone there. And I don't have my pick. You should have brought my pick with me. Try to get those gravel beetles. So if we, if we look there, we're between here and here. So we must be heading there. Oh, hey. Hey, hey, hey. They heard me. But they're not that smart. Drop the pack. If I can get the drop on this guy. Which I doubt it's gonna happen here. Doggy sees me. Let's just make it happen. <laughs> Don't make me teach you juggernaut, man. With your own weapon? It's gotta be. He's down. Oh my goodness. This hyena. That second. That's. Oh my god. He's down. He's down. Stop over. Stop overdoing it. John, we're going to go ahead and take a potion. I have no primitive bones. Where did I kill this guy? Okay, he's here. It's got a full padded set now. I got. Oh, well. Yeah, of course. I'm overweight because. And this is why you don't loot without your backpack on. Um, do we want to try to go for the full padded? It's the full padded set right there. I mean, uh, if we if we get all the stuff, we can make a full set of Amalite now as well. Where does the weapon go? It's Iron Great Hammer. We can make another one of those... Uh, Things we made before the great club. Uh, there we go. Oh, you're not gonna let me climb up there. All right, I see how it is. The tower up there or is it over here? That's oh, over here. Okay. I feel like we're missing something. This is just called the Ancient Ruins. OK. 
can't go in there. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hello. So, why can't I go in here to go down there? That's what I would think you would do, right? Missing something here? Let's go over here. So I can't go past this point. I can fall down there. can go this way somehow it looks like that that's attached on this side okay I can't go this way yet Okay, so this is a safe spot right here. It's got some clean water. Gazebo there. This is such a weird place. Nothing. our only other option oh oh I see a cave never mind all right let's before we go into this cave let's take uh, let's do a few things here uh, torch is probably getting low it's not that bad. We could juggernaut this thing, but I think what we're using currently is the better way to go. Uh, pirate's hideout. Alright, so humans maybe? That doesn't look human. Okay. Can't tell. Oh. What, what is this? What is this? It's a vase. Some decoratives. Pretty sure that's, yeah, that looks like a skeleton over there. What's going on here? What is this? some stew all 
I go ahead and get rid of burn concentration. Get rid of a little bit of burn mana. And uh let's go ahead and use this guy. I think pretty much all we can do here is hope for the best. he carrying? What's he have on him? I can't tell. Looks like a pirate lord though. Am I doing any damage? I am doing damage so let's get he got knocked down. That's that's all I care about. If, oh my goodness though. He is hitting hard. Holy cow. Okay, okay, okay. That's not good. Oh, I'm down. I'm dead. Oh, jeez. Okay. It's going to take us right outside because there was that safe spot, I bet. We had him. We had him so close. I just got too, um, too trigger happy. We can take him down, though. He is... He is so close. And that weapon of his. Uh, you wake up and see bandits trying to hand. Uh, trying your hand. Tying your hands together. And chaining you to a line of, uh, of prisoners. A lash from a whip stings your back as you. Uh, as you are ordered to run through the night. Your captors run you ragged until their camp finally enters your vision. A wave of nausea from the death march you were forced to make rises from your stomach and you vomit onto the cold hard ground before falling into your own mess. But the time you get uh, by, by the time you get back up, you're alone. You seem to have no use for they, they seem to have no use for sick people. Okay. So, I'm looking at where we are. This is the other side of the bandit camp that we were at. Wait a minute. Is, is the place that we were just at up there? I'm confused by this. What's, the, what's this? It's another one of those beasts. Well, um, we ended up at, uh, at Yazan's, um, boat. Didn't get to finish taking on that captain, but let's go ahead and get a, our fire up here. Oh, okay. Let's, uh, let's look around over here then. Gather seaweed. Okay, here's a chest here. Interact with the Argosian, uh, Ar Ar Argensen stash. This must be the stash Yuzan told me about. With the careful luck, you find a hidden compartment containing the goods. A metal panel is hid, uh, is hidden beneath the wood five element surface and uh, under under close uh, scrutiny a skull two stars embedded in its eyes the sun a fish and a red moon 
to the moon, right? And then the stars. Stars move slowly in the rusty mechanism, then finally gives way, revealing a secret drawer. The stash consists of a purse full of coins, a dagger, and a bottle. Nice, uh, this stuff is coming with me. Okay, so I got a Gabberry wine, a dagger. Oh, that's pretty cool. Okay, that's it for that. Nice. Can I get into this? I'm guessing no. I'm guessing the answer to that is going to be a hard no. Oh, he's going to take bandages. What's this? Something over here? Well, I think what we're going to do is leave this for next time. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Hopefully you liked it. And if you did... Hit, hit that like button. And if you want to see more, subscribe. This has been Cypher Deck. Peace out.